What percentage speed should you be hitting it with the driver? We're going to head to the Grand to do an experiment today because I've been hitting some shots on the golf course recently with the driver at 50% speed and had some great results. So I actually want to figure out what's going on, how fast is it actually going when I'm swinging at 50%, but also what percentage should my stock shot be? Let's head to the Grand and find out. We're taking this seriously. Got to have a good warm up. Cool down a little bit by the time you get onto the uh, probably the 15th is where we're going to try and get out to. I think but... I need a good 20 minutes to warm up. <laughs> get the body moving. Get a few wedges, a few 8 irons, a few 7 irons. It's definitely harder the old, older you get for a warm up, that is for sure. All right, so we've made it up to the 15th hole what here. Hole, by the way? I mean, how good is this at the Grand? I mean, look at that. It looks like a small fair, but it's actually not, not bad, is it's it? It's pretty bad. So look, we've got a couple of reasons for doing this. Obviously, the first one is, as we said, we get this question asked all the time, whether it's online or whether on the lesson tee. But the second reason, Andy, you've actually got a good example of how this worked for you, haven't you? Yeah, so um, it was a couple of years ago, actually, played St Andrews and I injured my wrist, fell out of a golf cart, <laughs> smashed a bone, um, and it wasn't repaired. So I said, right, I want to play St Andrews, but I couldn't play at full speed. So I actually played the whole round, hitting every single shot, at 50% power, 50% with everything. And the strange thing was, I had the best driving round for a long time. But the thing is also, the ball was going a long way. So what felt 50% speed was actually going a long way. And I was like, wow, this is different. And recently I've had a few games of golf where I've implemented some 50% speed shots. So we thought, right, well, let's have an experiment to figure out what the actual 50% feel is producing. We've got flight scope here. And then to figure out where I need, I need my stock shot, where's my percentage on the average shot? Can I push it up or does it need to come down to produce the best results? And this is something that you can do. So the, the good thing with this is the experiment we're asking you to do, we actually don't know the results for you on this, do we, no. Andy? So we're actually going to find this information out just today for yeah. the first time. Pierce as well. asked me, he says, do you want to hit one before? I'm like, no, I want to <laughs> do it just live. Yeah. Okay, so, so we've got this on here. What are you going to do first then, Andy? So first of all, we're going to do a stock shot just to figure out what, what my stock shot is. And then we're going to go 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, and then maybe experiment with a full on blaster at 100. See if we can do that. Well, so it I'm, said, I'm building up to that. It's gone on to sleep mode on here, so hopefully you're not on sleep mode as well sleep back at home. Oh, wake, I'm on wake mode, right. Stock shot then. Watching it, I don't care about you. This is the benchmark. <laughs> this is just sort of course mode stock shot. Okay, course mode stock shot. Let's see what you got. And you take that tee shot on this hole. Oh, that was a beauty. So that's, I'd say that's, look, I'm happy with that. That was good. I'd say that's my stock shot, roughly, on course. 119, 119 miles per hour. 119, wow. Okay, 119 miles per hour, right. So there's my stock shot. Okay, so 119, I'm, look, I'm happy with 119. That's better. I would have thought about 117-ish, but 119 is good. It's warm here in San Diego. So let's start then. This is what I'm really intrigued to know, 50%. I'm going to have a couple of balls with 50 and then work through. Now it's feeling, remember, just a feel. This is hard to do. If you try this, it's a tricky one to do. So I've got to be honest with my, with my feel on this and go, well, was that 50? So, okay, 50% power. That felt, that felt 50% power. Again, fairway. So that was 103. 103. 103 okay. club head speed. So that's the, this is amazing, isn't it? Because I felt like I just tapped that but it's only took off 16 miles per hour. But this is the difference, feel compared to real. Let me hit another one. Okay, left in the, <laughs> in the crap, but speed wise, yeah, pretty happy with the speed wise. Yeah, and that's definitely fast. That was 109 that was. 109. So do me another 51, let's just go another 50%. I think yeah. we need to do another one. And this is why it's difficult. It is difficult to train. Okay. I, it's weird, but for me looking at that, it looked like it was a little bit faster. Okay, yeah, yeah. That was more like the first one. Okay, felt like a pitch shot. Yeah. That's what that's what it feels like to me. Fifty percent speed pitch shot. One hundred three point six. I actually think it might have been one hundred three point six before as okay. well. So it's not 50, it's not fifty percent. This is the key thing. Now I use this shot when I want to hit a fairway. I've used this recently, and, it, and I'm going. If I want to keep it in play, I'm just doing a pitch swing with the, with the driver, and it feels great. So I actually played with one of our friends, Matt Blackie. He hit one full out down this one hole, and I was like, I want to, I want to hit my driver here, but two iron wasn't quite enough. So I hit a 50% speed one, and he went five yards past his full out one, so that was good. <laughs> he, he only swings at 85 he's, he's, though, doesn't he? He's a better player than me. He only swings at 85 though. <laughs>
Okay, 60%, yeah? 60%. So yeah, I think, look, you got a 103, 103 and a 109. But as we said, I don't think that was a 50% effort one. Best one so far, apart from the first one you actually hit. Okay, that felt like 60, I'd say. 106. Okay, yeah, so that's three mile per hour faster. Yeah, maybe slightly faster. Yeah, mate, but it felt similar, that did. Felt similar. No, no, 104, yeah, 104.4. Okay, so only a few mile an hour, so. You can carry 240 on that, as I say, you are going downhill. Okay, felt faster, didn't go all, all out. It went, it, it went all out right. It, all out <laughs> it wasn't right. your best shot. I'm not bothered about the fair 109. Way. Yeah, and that was 246, so it just wasn't obviously quite as good a shot. Okay, but yeah, 109. 109. Not going to remember all these numbers, by the way, at the end. 103, I'm 10. Sure I'll put them on screen. Yeah, good. That's a good idea. But this is just a good experiment <laughs> to do because, first of all, you try hitting the drive 50%. Your brain kicks in with the driver and just goes, I want to go hard. But it's a really, like, like I said, what I think about when I'm doing this, I feel like I'm doing the 50% speed like a pitch shot. So I just feel like everything is working together. I haven't got this big leg drive. Yeah. For me, it's just, I've used this shot on the course and it's just been brilliant, like 50% feel, but I'm still getting close to, close to, closer to full out. 70% yeah. well, one more, yeah? I think, I think what I'd be really interested in, I'm sure Andy is as well, where do you think you are right now? Put it down in the comments down below. Let us know what you think your percentage effort level is on your driver. Nice shot. Oh, I just feel, do you know what I feel? I feel so in control. I mean, what's that one? 109 again. 109, so 109. Yeah. That feels so in control and I'm still getting high speed. I'm only, I'm only 10 mile an hour down off my stock shot. So I'm you're gonna one, go up to 80 now, mark. yeah? I'm going 80 Yeah. Now. So 109, so we've got 103, 105, 109. Okay, that's nice. Yeah, big jump up that time, 116. 116, really. Mm. It, it, to be fair though, it, it kind of looked like you were hitting a golf shot when we were playing golf that day. Yeah, I mean, the difference is now is that really what I'm starting to do is I feel to do this, I'm starting to get these going where before I almost feel as if my arms are working down. Yeah. So I'm just feeling that this is quieter and it's more like a pitch shot. Now on that, I'm, I'm getting this sort of stretch, which is, which is maybe why it's hard as we go higher it's maybe harder to, to, to dial it down because as soon as you try ramping up the speed. It's just necessary, isn't it then? Yeah. So 160, let me do one more at 80%. Yeah. Yeah, again, if yeah, I'm, nice if, yeah, exactly. I'm nice, great right balance. Well, that's still shy of a stock shot. Yeah, 117. 117, okay. That's about right because if you go back to this 90 now, effort that you had before, it's going to be near that 119, isn't it? You think so? I, I think we'll, we'll know now if I go 90 where my stock is. Yeah, cool. I think, yeah, 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 you go. Yeah, you're right. Was that harder than you would normally do on the course? Good shot, um, by the way. I'd say that's pretty similar. Not much difference. That was nice, but that's got to, that was probably the best one I've hit so far. That's 122, that was. So that's definitely, that's definitely, yes, 122. Okay. So that's, that's I'm, like. I'm warming up as well. Yeah. I would say I see you hit golf shots like that on the course with yeah. that much effort yeah, yeah. and that much speed. Sometimes it depends on where you are in, the, in a game and yeah. what the hole looks like. I don't think I'm going to go much harder than that though. Right. What are you doing now? 100? I think let's go 100. Okay. I mean, this is hard because... <laughs> I've got to try not to get injured now. That's the key thing. <laughs> You're not thinking about that, are you? It's actually a good hit as well. Oh, yeah, I mean, that was a nice hit. Int I'm really interested to see what that is. Speed wise. 122.7. Really? 122.7? Wow. Let's go again. 122.7. So, but this is the interesting uh, factor here is that sometimes you think you, you've put in loads into it, like 10% jump here, sometimes might not give you that feel, you know, and then, and then you got to understand is it worth going all out or can you hit 90% and swing it faster because your body's sequencing a bit better we are talking about 150 a little bit of a recoil there never normally see you on that on the golf course 124 on that one Ooh, 124 right. not quite as good a shot we just cut out a bit didn't it yeah, exactly. wind got it bottom of the face so i'm sacrificing strike now so that would have that would have been the highest speed yeah. but that is not going to be the highest distance didn't carry over 300 the, 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 the high spin 
So this yeah. is the key thing. You've got to figure out what that... And I'm going to hit one more shot and then I'm going, to, I'm going to settle on where my speed is. Okay. Okay. Great experiment for you, though, at home, doing this. This is just brilliant because you really will be able to dial in. Maybe even the difference between a an, an fairway finder and a bomb tee shot. So you may well have a shot. Yeah, it's a good hit. A little I'll bit left. I even try to launch that one a bit higher as well. Yeah. Yeah, 123.3. Okay. So. That Shows is, you, doesn't it? I'm a little bit out of breath now, but that's the max one. Let's say 124 was what I maxed out at. Yeah. 119 was my stock shot. Um, so I would say my, I'm going to say that my, my stock is, I'd say, ranges, depends on the shot, the, the situation between 85 and 90. That's my sweet spot, I think, for, for my stock drive. But the one thing that I am using is that 50% feel, and we know the 50% feel is actually 103 mile an hour, which doesn't lose me that much distance. But the feel gives me so much more control. I feel if I do this pitch motion, because on the golf course situation as well, when you're in the, a match, that 50 feel might actually be slightly higher. Yeah. So it so, might be so amped up at 10% it, it anyway. So yeah, I agree with that. It's, uh, uh, it's very rarely going to go the other way. Okay, guys, hope you enjoyed that. Make sure you actually just give that a go and let us know in the comments what your percentage was. And also, if you enjoy our coaching, you can access our five shots lower coaching series in the description. Thanks for watching and we'll see you soon.